What's going on guys? It's been a rainy, nasty week. It's finally cleared up a little bit, so let me show you what uh, I'm driving for the week. This of course is the Volkswagen Atlas, but it is the R-Line, which is a Volkswagen Atlas I haven't actually talked to you guys about before. Now obviously I reviewed the 2018 Atlas and then I liked it so much that I went out and bought one for my family and I put a video out about this. So this is gonna be the third video within a year where I'm talking about an Atlas. But again, this is the R-Line, so uh, let's see what's special about this one. So obviously I think the Atlas has a really good looking design. I like the more boxy shape. It definitely looks like a bigger SUV and I think it looks really good. Specifically for the R-Line, um, it is available with 20 inch alloy wheels, uh, the R-Line grille, special front and rear bumpers and side skirts. All right, let's move along to the interior and check that out. And now we're sitting inside the Atlas and it's not a ton different than my base Atlas that I have, um, but it's a really nice car. It's got leather seats instead of the cloth seats that I have. It's got the bigger infotainment system and it's got some nice wood trim in it. Let's take a closer look around. Specific to the R-Line's interior, you'll find stainless steel pedal caps, badging on the steering wheel, and a special welcome screen. Nothing too special or different about the way that it drives. It's pretty much the same driving experience that mine in my driveway has. Now the obvious question is inevitably gonna be, did I make the right choice buying the base model or should I have done what I suggested in my first video and gone for the upper trim? This is definitely a nice vehicle in this trim level, but it is an extra $15,000. Um, for my family, I'm pretty happy with the decision that I made. And if you're looking at one and you have the extra 15 grand to spend, definitely this R-Line is a great vehicle. If you don't and you're still looking for the best bang for your buck in terms of size, the base trim with the V6 is still a really fantastic vehicle. Um, and it's worked out well for me and my family so far. It's definitely amazing at just how quick this weather changes. Just 20 minutes ago, it was pouring down rain, and now roads look a little bit dry and uh, the sun's starting to poke out. But um, in the next 15 to 20 minutes, it's supposed to be hitting us with rain again. Texas weather. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, please hit that thumbs up button. Uh, if you got any questions on the Atlas, leave them down below in the comments and I'll try to respond. And as always, thanks for watching. <laughs>